Right there, beautiful. Give me that again. For him, they say his career is on the line. For me, uh, everything is on the line. I, I, that's how I treat every fight. I've been boxing about all my life. I don't get nervous for this. If you get nervous, you're in the wrong sport. I mean, that's that's probably how they're trying to put it, like uh, like I'm a pushover, a walkover, or something like that, but they're going to be in for a rude awakening. A goal of mine is I want to be a unified world champion, but you know, um, I just want to help boxers. I love the sport. I want to uh, continue to help help other fighters grow as long as myself, and you know, uh, just get back to the sport, what he gave to me. So you went boom, boom. You gonna bring it back, but this is like a limp. Check it out. Uh, Jermaine works and mitts with the kids at home. He teaches them a lot. He's he's really a great fan of giving back. He trained those guys maybe about a few days a week. Along with his training, after he gets get done with his training, he jumped right in with them. It's definitely going to help his game because when you're, when you're teaching, you're learning. And so that's the plan, you know, you teach and learn at the same time. Good, get him back up top again. That's it, good work, give him up top again. One, two, up two, up two. I got with Jermaine about 12 years ago, and he first came to me. He was a game fighter. He was game then, and he had confidence. And I knew that if I get a guy with confidence and they hungry for the sport, I could definitely work with him. And he came out winning. He won a couple of state championships, and it went carried on the national championships. And here we are now in the professional ranking. Uh, life, life would have been totally different. Uh, yeah, <laughs> life for me probably would have been totally different. Uh, I got mixed up in some stuff, you know, uh, as a child. But uh, boxing and Coach Jesse helped me see a different light. Helped me, uh, you know, travel, see different stuff. So you know, boxing gave me a different outlook, a, a good different output on life. Uh, you know, um, a different vision on how life is and how it could be. Anthony Joshua said he chopping trees, but we chopping tires. We ain't slipping nothing. We chopping tires, we running in the sand, we running in the midnight, we running in the early morning, we running between the day, we don't sleep. All we do is work, work, work. Come April 1st, the progress is gonna be seen. Hi, 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 Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Right there, Tim. Hey, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Yep, 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 yep. three. Yeah, Hollywood, Hollywood Beach. Getting it in, grinding, you know? Training in that sand. Making it hard for the legs. So you can move the legs in this, you can move the legs in anything. Conditioning changed a lot. Uh, you know, for the Dillon fight, I was I was working a job before we got that phone call. So uh, I, wasn't, I, was, I wasn't in the gym. We, we took like uh, five to seven weeks to got a shape for that fight, so. Uh, by the time I had, I did what I could. But now this time I got, I got more time to prepare. I got more time to get in shape. So, uh, you know, we're taking this one, we're doing, doing all we can. Everything happened for a reason. Uh, if, you, if you do lose a fight, you want to learn from it. You don't want to, you don't want to lose a lot, but you do lose, you learn more from a loss than you will win. And we definitely learned from this one. Um, I show people what I can do. Um, I show people I can hang up there with, with some of the best, you know. Uh, Dylan's a, a top 10, top 15 fighter, so um, I show people what I'm capable of. I don't feel like I lost, so we came home and we worked on stuff. We uh, got better, perfected our craft, learned some different techniques, different ways to attack, and, you know, uh, just keep progress. My performance most definitely led to this fight, because um, he could have picked anybody he wanted to, but he chose me, so uh, maybe he's trying to prove something that he could do to me that Dylan couldn't, you know, who knows. But. Uh, like I said, I don't play. We don't play boxing, so, you know, I, I come here to wake him and the rest of the world up. Um, I feel like I'm winning, hands down, at the end of the fight, but, um, you know, as far as him with the trainers and stuff, you know, I can't pinpoint on what kind of style he's going to try to use. We just, as a boxer, our job is to be prepared for whatever style. They finna, they finna get ready to see a new improved Jermaine Franklin. You know, they finna see me come out and fight a way better fight than I fought in a dinner fight, you know. Um, it's time for people to take me serious. I feel it's my new dawn coming in, so, you know, um, it's really just time to, to make my claim, make my stake.
Oh, most definitely. I wanna, I wanna knock his ass out. That's the goal.